<laughs> well, I suppose we can just get into it then if uh, train sim's gonna crash. It's fine. I started the stream to get people gathering and uh, yeah, well, uh, <clears throat> it's uh, being a silly thing. So we'll, we'll see about this. But uh, as context for once uh, train sim feels like living, uh, while I was out in the uh, very state that uh, the S1's from, uh, the S1 got released for uh, for Train Sim, and apparently it goes really fast. So we want to uh, we want to try and see what we can do with it. Welcome everyone to the stream, and you guys are ridiculous already. Let's see if I can catch up. Welcome everybody. Ezekiel zero three four engineer for four months. Good man. Thank you as always, Andrew Bayer. Hello from Washington State once again. Yes, hello need to come see you midland 1072 productions with 20 memberships was the t-shirt at the east broad top not enough spoilers spoilers thank you midland ezekiel <laughs> 10 as well thank you and evil me oh my goodness guys come on we haven't even started running a train yet oh good heavens <clears throat> And John Deerboy, there you are. Hey, hi, love your content. As always, keep up the awesome work. Cheers. Cheers to you guys as well. Oh, good God. I did not mean to launch the scenario again. I want to put down a choo-choo. Kroom is a member for two months. Right on. It's Jasper Grill fan ID. You don't want to crash today. Why did you cut off the bread? Why? We can no longer teleport bread. I, d I didn't cut it off. Hang on. Ha! See, look. You can you can even you can hear it. <laughs> so uh, it is. Uh, it did uh, it did have to go off because the the mustache was a little much, and uh, we were filming important things, and I didn't want to just be stuck with a, a silly mustache for months on end. So I had to. Shave the mustache. I would do. I do have sideburns down to here, though. It's very retro heist. The the beard will be back. It's fine. Choo choos. Let's see. Yes. 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 This big giant dumb thing. I'm excited. Dunk. There we go. Oh. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, you put the tender down and it explodes. That's a neat trick. Anyway, let's catch up while we're here. Did the mallard come out of a quacker jackbox? Limes. Jack Carson's <laughs> record videos. This is a bucket. Yes. Jello. Did Doc Mr. Dr. Professor Heiss, is it WNB motor car time yet? No, not yet. Jordan Freeman just got home from a President's Day weekend trip to Universal Orlando. Eight-hour drive. I don't envy you. I had quite the uh, the travels back from Pennsylvania yesterday. Three-hour drive from the broad top to Philadelphia, to, followed by a four-hour plane ride, and then an hour drive home. Made for a, a long day. Wasn't as bad as the day going there with two planes, but luckily I had a non-stop. Anyway, let's see about getting this thing figured out we'll, we'll try northeast corridor one more time i figured northeast corridor would be the best one to try because speed but yes noisy white yutch riding your bike home from work oh well supposed good time of any <laughs> well don't uh, don't pay too much attention to me Midland 1072. Spoilers, Heiss is as awesome as, as he in person as he is online. Well, thank you. That was, it was a fun freaking weekend. Okay. We, we, we're, we're, I don't know if we want to attempt uh, insanity here. So maybe we won't put the train down on the same track. Maybe we'll try the de-skirted one. I don't know. Keep in mind, she'll do 120 wide open in the corner. That doesn't make any sense, Pancakes. But I mean, train sim. So, you know, what? we'll just we'll just delete the AM7. We'll yeet it, and then we go get we get our choo choo. Okay, it's not the mere existence of the the giant tender that's the problem. You can place it. So, 
Smokey, you can... <laughs> what? You can his damn face WTF lines also Weezer moment. I'm not sure what you mean, Smokey, but thank you. <laughs> Talladay 56. Any more three quarters of an idiot videos coming out soon? Also, how are you doing? I was actually editing the next one a little bit before this. Uh, and I gave myself an, an allotment of time. I wanted to live stream tonight. So I was like, okay, I'll live, you know, I'll work on this till eight, see how far I get. And if I get far enough, I'll just try and slam it out. But if I don't get too far, uh, I'll stop. And uh, eight o'clock rolled around and I had been laughing at what will become a conductor's only video <laughs> for probably 15 minutes straight. Um, yeah, there's, uh, there's a bit that's uh, very silly that we... Yeah, it can't, uh, that can't go on the internet. Not publicly, at least. But it's very funny. Anyway, look, we have a choo-choo and we can drive it now, theoretically. Cool. Beautiful. Okay. <laughs> so, yes, that will be coming. How am I doing? I am exhausted. Um, long, wonderful weekend. Uh, I slept for a bunch today, but hopefully uh, a little more sleep tomorrow and we'll be good. Bunny, a conductor for eight months. Cheers. Cello, the one time you actually make it to a stream and we go fast. Oh boy, yes. Engineer for two months. <laughs> no, no, see why bitch. No! You're watching your phone too contently and you crashed. Single tier. Zach slash panda. Broad is truly in the middle of nowhere, but the weekend was amazing. Absolutely. Yes. Can go up to 197 in the smoke box challenger. Good heavens. Quick drive, use quick drive. Blue, it uh, it wouldn't load, like I couldn't find the engine in quick drive. It wasn't an option. I don't know why. But here we have it, and now we can pull amp fleets. Okay, um, let me catch up on the super chats and then we'll stare at this thing some. Corey Gibson, is that Kenosha I smell? Not tonight for me at least, but uh, Kenosha may be in the future of the trains. Cruise Master does games. You just got those add-ons. They're really good. Also just saw the broad top short. You can't wait. You're still driving light rail. Oh, cool. Four doors, more horrors. What are the different rail gauges? Also, Woody Wood says three foot big boy. There are many different gauges. <laughs> A101A. Remember, Brakeman for five months. Five more months, five more drinks. I'm, uh, I'm abstaining this evening, but thank you. Uh, I will have those five drinks uh, at some other time. Colonel Cactus upgrading to conductor. Thank you. Mike Stanley, welcome to the Fireman as well. Some good videos. Go check them out. And Waifu Scientist Gambler joining the engineers. Well, thank you. Goodness, guys. Thank you so much. This is, uh, oh, goodness. Does it fit in the, I mean, it should fit in the loading gauge. Survey says no. No, it does not. <laughs> this thing is like Penzi. Why? Why with the six axle lead truck? Why duplexes? Why? Why? Why everything, Penzi? Six axle truck. We need more axles. We just, just more, more axles. Okay, we need to know. Tunk. Oh, good God. It's got a very nice cab interior. I, you know, not gonna lie, I was not expecting that. This is cool. Oh, and it's got cab signal? What? Come on, Penzi. Cab signal on both sides of the cab. That's cool. Before we yeet off into a blue, I wanna just keep staring at this real quick. I don't know what the hell kind of air brakes this is. These handles don't look like any handles I know. I don't know if that's model or if that is what. Train brakes released. <laughs> Evil me, thank you. No beer tonight, so you'll, you'll sponsor your drink of water. Thank you. Oh, we can bail the independent. Okay. So this is some kind of like flavor of 24 or something, maybe. Beeman upgrading to fireman. Thank you. Bandan, you want to see some beans out of this thing? Yeah, well, we're going to do that just as soon as I figure out all the things about the cab. Standard, yes. Pennsylvania. 
All right, we got the good old gift fire, MSTS vibes. We got a big stoker. And we got valves. Oh God. I did not read anything about this. I hope it's like, I hope that it's a detailed sim, but at the same time, I kind of, uh, Stoker booster, Stoker engine. Okay. Is that doing things? That is doing things. That's increasing the, f oh God. Stoker jet steam on. Okay, well, we'll just turn some of these things on and then we'll, uh, we'll just start sending it, I guess. Show them Brits who's the real speed queen. You got it, pass, pass. Taladay, thank you for the gifted membership. Bell's over here. That's fun. Dy Dynamo, live injector heater. That's a very convenient place for the blower, Penzi. All right. Uh, where's the loud thing? Oh, we got light switches. We're just gonna turn them all on. Make it brighter than the sun. Uh, okay. Power reverse forward. Did that do anything? Bonus points if it did something. It did something. That's cool. Bonus points achieved. I don't... I'm not sure what that is. Where there? Where is the dangly? Where is the dangly thing that makes me happy? Light up lamps. Is there no whistle? Oh, that's fun. Chain powered roof hatch. Where in the Pennsylvania Railroad? Oh. It sounds like a cow. It didn't have a whistle. It just had a horn. No. No. <laughs> no. Why did we choose to do this today? <laughs> okay, let's just make this thing go fast. It's disappointed me immeasurably. Oh, it's got cylinder cocks somewhere, doesn't it? Where, where, if, if I was the Pennsylvania Railroad, where would I put them? Injector water. Okay. Injector overflow, bell, okay. It's probably not like a smoke box thing where it just yeets your scenario for doing something. That sounds fun. And the valve gear is actually animated properly, which is exciting. All right, well, this thing start, starts to put out the yard. Why are my cab signals not up? Did we not? I thought we turned on, went, well. Whatever. Why is there just a horn? <laughs> Dies. All right, let me catch up on chat here. Frame rate 24, breakman for seven months. YouTube does chat milestones. Yes, they do. Blue with another 10 memberships, thank you. Tyler Sibley, hi, hi, love your content, needs speed and power. Yes, that is the, the, the point of today. Squiddy2004, so glad you could catch this stream. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, the game did not crash. Thought it did. Lucas BG with a gifted membership, thank you. 
Corey Gibson, what's the difference between the S1 and the T1? The S1's a 6446, and the T1 is a 4444. Um, the S1, there was only ever one of, I think. And then the T1, there were many. I don't, I don't really know that much. And yeah, you're right, I do still have this thing in the corner, and it is just not really caring. And, and I open the throttle wide, and the steam, the steam rate, there's just no steam sim. All right, well, the throttle's on the ceiling, so I guess we'll just do that. Speed. Well, we're losing coal now, though. I don't know if this matters, but that's the Stoker booster. We'll just wide that open. Yes, break the needle off. <laughs> Put coal in the hole. Thomas Perry, another month. Cheers from Shenandoah Valley. Cheers to you. Good God. I hate to think of what you're doing to valve gear being in the corner this long. It is a good looking engine, but good, like, it does have too much lead and trail truck. Like, I'm not sure what the Penzi uh, fascination with four drivers a piece was, but it's fine. Night Fury King, conductor for three months. What's up? You're playing Train Some Classic running the big boy. That's exciting. Four Doors Mahars. So for the people who don't know what an S1 is, right. So this is a Pennsylvania Railroad 6446. We kind of talked about it a little bit with that comparison to the T1. Um, I believe they only made one of them, and it was known for being stupid fast, but it had too much weight not on the drivers, and that caused it some problems, which is why they didn't make more of them. But one of the many Pennsylvania Railroad ex uh, experiments to go speed, go fast. I smell Kenosha. Me too. It's a Moo Moo train. I'm a Lynn Armstrong. Yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> Got it. Nailed it. Put it in the game. <laughs> 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 oh, I clicked off again. That's what I get. If you've ever played Age of Mythology from like 2000 or 1999, that is the sound that the cows make. Changed my mind. Zion, in this video, will ice crash first or will the game? Well, the game's already crashed. Oh god, we're already doing 120. So that's fine. You would be bouncing all over the damn place right now. I don't know what the speed limit is. I don't know if we care. They didn't exactly make this hard because you could just leave it just whacked in the corner. Well, there goes Mallard's record. How fast does it go? Good God. And the mechanical lubricators are animated and that's fun. The, the, the rumor mills that I've always heard is that people said that these could do 140 mile an hour when they timed them. It's supposed to be quick. Drusilla Lishborn. Likeborn? I'm not sure. Been a month. Yes, thank you. Smoke. Give it coal, damn it. Well, he did. More coal? Yes. S1 was free steaming, so this might be accurate, says Blue. Blue, I don't think so, man. Uh, we're, you, you, you could not have the valve gear in the corner and go 144 miles an hour and be maintaining MAW. Like, that is just, that, uh, like, no. No. Maybe it could generate steam pretty well, but I, I sincerely doubt that it could do this. particle effects don't know what to do as we're going 147 miles an hour. Good God. Speed and power, yes. Jeremy Clarkson faces. <laughs> More coal? Yes, Smokey. Ryan Rail. Fun fact, Southern Pacific 4449 has the same horn. Yes, and you're chum. 
If you haven't seen the video that says your chum, yeah. 153 mile an hour is the number that the Pennsylvania Railroad was fined for. All right, so this engine got fined for going 153 miles an hour, but somehow uh, somehow Mallard's record is the, the real one or something. I don't know. Details. Brent Hinshaw, more beans! Thank you. Yes, more beans. Secret sauce is beans, Jacoby Irish, yes. In Midland. What are your impressions on Southern Valve Gear? This is an amazing time this past weekend. Yeah, Southern Valve Gear is weird. I said that like six times every day. Southern Valve Gear is weird. I still don't entirely get it. I have some things that I understand about it now, but um, I still don't 100% get it. This, uh, the S one's free. It's free on the DSG DRR website. If you just Google PRR S1, it's literally free. I wouldn't say the sim is terribly great, but... Oh, we are just casually doing 150 mile an hour with these am fleets right now. <laughs> One of the few locomotives to challenge 611 for the BBC word. Yes! Yes! Yes, indeed. Somebody gave me a 3D print of a, of a 611 meme when I was at the Broadtop, and uh, it was the funniest funniest thing I received all weekend. It's uh, over in another room, although it doesn't show it. Welcome, Jones. Happy to catch a Heights stream. Much love from a fellow Narragator from Tasmania. Well, cheers. The <laughs> Pangolin Party. Con! Yes. It's been a minute since I talked to Con because I've been out on trips and stuff. We're probably going to record tomorrow, I think. Oh, the boiler water level is almost out. That's probably a problem. All right, let's figure out how to get the injector going. Exhaust injector water on. Bell. Oh, that's the cylinder cogs up there. Okay. Injector overflow. Well, you want that, right? To start the gun? It's not making any particle effects. That's fine. Um, I don't even know what that is. The water level is still not coming up, so... Right. Right. Oh, hey, look, our cab signals are working now. That's good. Oh, that's the bell. Why is that a valve that you close? What? Does anyone know how to put water in this thing before I blow it up? Oh, it's probably the ratchet. He said, going 150 miles an hour with no water in the boiler. It's fine. Does it Stoker vein control? Steam heat. Live injector steam. There we go. Why? Oh, the starting valve's up there. Okay. Steam heat. Stoker steam, which is already open. Blower steam. We don't need any blower right now. Dynamo supply. Oh, so these are the turret root valves for everything. Feed water heater. That's on. Water glass top. God, this thing is bouncing around everywhere. Cylinder cock supply. <laughs> Isn't that just called the steam chest? Have we started putting water in this thing? Driver increase, decrease injector water. Well, hopefully that's doing something. It's been sitting at 0.08 for a minute there. That's the bell. We know that. Cab signal still tells me that I'm good, clear, straight, so that's cool. Is this just cab signal? No? I don't know what that switch is. Hate that. What's that? Sander, sander brake valve? What? 
double head. Oh, those are the, the cutout cocks and things. Are there stuff on the back? Oh, there's a dump. Got our extra dump. Cool. Oh, we got more light switches. This thing had a lot of lights. Okay, the water level has increased to 0.09. So we've prevented a boiler explosion, so that's exciting. And we're just cruising along at 149 and a half miles an hour. That's fine. <laughs> oh, good heavens. Beat your record of 173 and Hinchoff or Hinchcliffe. I'll try. Dwarded, so is this one <laughs> it's gonna be running on California's high speed rail network? I wish. JD Tycoon 7-Eleven be watching the server names for a secret message. Okay. Exploding the train because he didn't add water. I mean, you know, what else is new? Oh man, I'm missing a bunch of these. Let's see. Brent Hinshaw, steam powered Shinkansen. Yeah, pretty much. Nathaniel Lombardi with 10 gifted memberships. Thank you. Marcus Fusen, semi smooth heist. What is my opinion of Frank Zappa? Frank Zappa is a weird dude, but he is a good guy. Oh, good God! Um, anyone have an idea what happened there? <laughs> Quick draw. Oh, you know, I probably wasn't, I was looking for S1 or PRR. Yeah, if we just do a quick drive and then we, oh God, we don't want to run this thing up the, no, we don't want to run this up Clear Creek. But why isn't the why doesn't that the route come up? I don't get why that does that. We could do Soldier Summit from Helper to Soldier Summit and then grab. Why not? Let's run it on Rear Grand territory just to be cursed. Class. Is it not there? Yeah, see it doesn't pop up in the quick quick drive options. Oh, there it is. Right. We had the skirted one, so we can try the de-skirted one. Does it, does it not get cars? I guess it doesn't get cars. Anyway. <laughs> uh, anyway, Frank Zappa. Right. Um, he has one of my favorite uh, music jokes ever, which is, I think, a, a, a react on my Discord. Um, which is just the sheet music just calls out both buttocks in, uh, in parentheses, which is very delightful. He's instructing the pianist to sit down on the keys because Frank Zappa, weird dude. All right. Well, we don't get cars, but we have, we have a bunch of rear grand stuff we could just grab. S1 hauling coal hoppers dot JPEG. Kick all the air off. It's fine. We don't need air. Hate that. Still hate that. Okay, let me let me scroll down and catch up to catch up to things here. <laughs> Look at all those pickups. That is the wrong forwards, friend. I guess we're probably on a grade. There you go. Base player 2011 iffy. There's only one S1 basically as proof of concept and contrast for 52 T1s made. Both were designed for passenger service. Gotta beat NYC, but only could run between Pitt and Chicago because they weren't articulated. Right, but duplexes. Thank you for that context and for the super chat. Chris Kelling, this wasn't an articulated engine. No. Duplex. So it's a rigid frame with two engines. All the pickups. Cruise Master does games. You gotta go. Extremely early run. Have fun. And there is Kenosha. Yep, precisely. Take it easy. Let's see if we get over here. 
And I just back onto that consist with the SD40 and just knuckle into it and then just be super cursed. John dear boy, I'm just gonna leave this here. Yes, thank you. My railroads online is showing, I'm just putting the bar in reverse. Well, these are CTC controlled. But I can press the button. Alright. <laughs> That's what happens when you use ham fleets, bunny. Nice. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Brennan Shaw did your own DuPont crash, I see. Oof. Oof. That's a bad one. All right. Andrew Lucia, for all that, all that the S1 suffered from wheel slip problems, never seemed to cause bad issues. It Wikipedia least lists its factor of adhesion at about 3.6, so it wasn't especially slippery, same as the J. Oh, it's less than four, but how fast could you get the S1 over Raton Pass? I guess we can find out, Skitty Cat. As soon as we uh, knuckle into this cursed consist of cursed cursedness. What's the hot key for independent brake? That's the train brake. There we go. Does the independent brake do anything? Oh god, that's in reverse still. Oh boy. Oh, 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 oh. Sorry, you you wanted to back this across a crossover? No, it's giant and rigid. It it can't do an S curve. Ah! <laughs> ah, right. Okay. Well, that didn't work. Oh, I clicked continue. Uh, gotta exit. Yeah, that's uh. Okay. Well, maybe we won't do that. I don't know if I have Raton Pass. Let me see. Drive. <laughs> Quick Drive, Soldier Summit, Cajon, Cheyenne, Clue Creek, Colorado Road. Oh, oh. Don't make me do that, guys. Donner Pass, East Coast Mainline, Great Western Mainline, Northeast. Oh, there's Northeast Corridor, Pacific Surfer Liner. I'm just bad at looking through this menu, apparently. Rasig Sherman Hill, Soldier Summit, Soldier Summit, the other half, Somerset, Dorset, Wasatch. West Highland line. Where 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 do we think? Everyone says the museum because because reasons, right? <laughs> oh god. Forgive me for I've sinned. It's a 28 degree curve. This thing is like 90 million feet long. It's not gonna buff. <laughs> uh, I got a direct message from the, the three quarter idiots. It's just from Brett and it says, tonight on Top Gear, Mark rides an electric cow into the sunset. <laughs> oh god s1 versus army of peewee tug of war i don't know peewee's got the the uh peewee's got the torque man <laughs> oh goodness <laughs> yeah, yeah, blue's true you lost the kessel drucked no we did not lose the kessel drucked we still have kessel drucked but uh we did we did try and break the train in half. It's fine. S1 had roller bearings. Probably had roller bearings for the um, for the boxes, if I had to bet. Doesn't look like it has roller bearings for all the rods. Looks like it might have one or two rollers. Oh, good heavens. It spawns in and goes... <laughs> well, this is going to work. He's already dead. He's already dead. Can I, can we, can we, 
I'm derailed, so controls no longer do anything. That's unfortunate. Rev, rev up those flange oilers. Yeah, that's, uh, there's your thumbnail right there. Mm-hmm. Okay, well, so we can, we can go, oh, can't go to the world editor from here. So we could go to the world editor of the museum. That's the secret. We go, we go edit the museum. We place it on straight track and we see how far around the railroad it can go. <laughs> Quebec gamer. How do you want your train to turn? No. I'm glad that that, uh, that mannerism has, has caught on with people. We were touring, uh, the Rock Hill Trolley Museum on Sunday and, uh, the, the lovely gentleman who was here earlier in chat, Brobus, uh, who's giving us the tour. Uh, <laughs> he said something all along the lines of like, how much of this do you want? Yes. And I was just like, oh, that's stupid things that I say. That's funny. Other people are saying stupid things that I say. I didn't imagine this. Ghost Games 302. Glad you got the stream this evening. Time to kick back. Enjoy Heist Play Trains while Kenosha plays on loop in your mind. Yeah, this has been a bit of Kenosha so far. <laughs> Stop playing with the S1. Well, no, it's fun. It's fun. <laughs> you have the COVID and this helps, so I'm sorry to hear that you have the COVID. Hope you get better. When I had COVID back in July, it was not terribly fun. So. Thankfully, it, it seems to be less bad than we once thought back in 2020. Anyway, uh, oh god. Did you know the floor is red? <laughs> I think the trains are over there. Right, can't use W. There's trees. What? What is going on in the editor of this level? Am I just in the floor? I think I might be in the floor. Yes, <laughs> I'm just in the floor. Sir Liv, the S1 was popular in fiction, appearing in Batman, Grim Fandango, the Galaxy Railways, and Meet the Robinsons. It's a very striking design, so. Yeah, all right. Hey, look, trains. I still don't know why the floor is red. Apparently, we need a uh, a warning about uh, seizures and stuff. <laughs> Should I move the narrow gauge consist out of the way? No, I don't think it makes a darn bit of difference. So DSGDRR, we do that. We go edit trains. <laughs> oh God, now we gotta do this twice. But the floor is no longer red, so there's that. Ever wondered what the, the underside of the museum looks like? It's a good track plan. Although it would, if you look at it, oh, it's mirrored. Any way you slice it, because we're looking at the bottom of it, right? So you look red. Okay. <laughs> Consist forty four forty nine with set sixteen cars. I'm sure that'd work. S one. Let's put the skirt on. Why not? Just occupy the crossing. It's fine. Train Sim, you're a stable game. <laughs> oh, goodness. 39 cars and leave it notch eight. May as well. Just turn the music. Yeah, the music is pretty quiet, isn't it? Good night, Richard Lintermute. Yeah. T tender first. Okay, that's the secret. Okay. All right, we're back in. I don't know if OBS has realized we're back in. There we are. Come on. It hasn't realized we're back in. But if I do that, it'll work. Whatever. Anyway. Let's try it again. Okay. 
John Deere Boy, live music tonight? Hell yeah, why not? Last time we didn't because I was trying to hide the fact of the mustache for Durango. Because that was very, that was too much fun. Uh, but of course, this time we're back to back to regularly scheduled programming, so sure. Ryan Rail, you're curious what is the rail line that passes by the museum? That is the BNSF Beer Run. It runs to the Golden Yard where uh, Coors uh, Brewery is supplied. Used to be old CNS. Papa Sickle, what's next to be cooked in the K37? I mean, in the K37, I don't know, but we cook burgers on the RGS20 tomorrow on the channel. By the way, spoilers. All right. Let's see. Oh, I probably need to reselect it now. Oh, no, it's already there. Okay. Where is the... There it is. Tender first. We've learned this lesson valuably. And then the engine causes the game to crash, crash just like just being placed with no error message about crashing. That's cool. One more time! <laughs> Timerman 765 hey, hi, so you hi highly recommend that you should watch a model train restoring YouTuber called SMT Mainline. He can restore a super old model train. Seriously, I recommend you watch. Sounds interesting. Uh, full, full disclosure, I don't really watch YouTube anymore. Because <laughs> I, I don't really have time to watch. Like, I'll occasionally do it. Um, so if I do end up looking for something to watch, I will go check them out. But... Um, until something changes in my uh, schedule of things. I, I don't tend to watch too much YouTube, which is kind of ironic, but anyway. Ginger Boy in Midland. Live music? 12 strings? Well, I mean, if both of you guys are uh, <laughs> gonna super chat about it, yes, we can, can leave it off, we'll lead off with that one. Gladly. Yes, it is T19 Kitchen uh, tomorrow again. K37 Kitchen it has the alliteration. It makes sense as a brand thing. It's fine. We'll cook on 491 again. Just eventually. We're not firing up for a couple months still, so. Okay. Scroll down. Grab tender. I don't even know what all this stuff is. Oh, we have a list of everything, that's why. Give me trains. Give me the skirt of tinder. Okay. So then we grab this one. Let it load in. Even place it on a track. Lovingly. And then dunk. I think it worked. How about that? Alright. Tunk. I mean, no. No. How do you get permission to cook foods in the locomotive? Where did the train go? Oh, you have to save the changes. <laughs> rabble, rabble, rabble! You have to save the changes. I just didn't want to end up with this S1 parked there forever. Uh, I asked Jeff. Hey, Jeff, can I do this? And then Jeff goes, yes. Croom, could it, I do 8th of January? Maybe? I honestly don't remember how to play it. It's an ancient uh, Civil War song. And I learned it, like, just to super quick to learn how to um, record it for the soundtrack. And then I kind of forgot about it. It's a nice song, but it's not one that I remember. I could try it. I'm sure I could figure it out pretty quick. It is my party trick. Tunk. Tender. We're tempting fate here by doing this again. Okay. <sighs> Getting crazy. Click. Alright. Boom. Yes! <laughs> Tuesday sunrise. That could be fun. It's a good one. Alright. 
Well, now the gates come down. We don't have track circuits at the museum. Come on. Cooking with grandma when she's back, of course. Might be a couple years. All right, Ta place your bets. How far are we making it? Go, go train, go. Try that again. <laughs> what, what part of the simulation is accurate? The fact that it's the giantest, rigidest, stupidest piece of stupid. All right, we're gonna we're gonna back up first. Kick the air off. Kick the all the air. Bail all the things. Let's back it up. Back it up. Is the switch lined? Oh! <laughs> Game crashed! <laughs> right. Well! Well then! <laughs> shall, we, shall we try? Try one more time. <laughs> this game never crashes. Yeah, I don't I don't know what you're talking about. It's fine. It's a question someone's inevitably going to ask when's Khan coming down to the museum. Hopefully sometime. I'd love to have Khan down. Oh, can we... Oh, you only have turntable lead for the quick drive. So if we do... Or is it a free room scenario? It's probably a free room scenario. Yeah. It's not a locomotive, it's a ship. Yes. Okay, one more time, then switch to Dero Valley and blow up the harbor again. You, you drive a hard bargain, Van Dam. You drive a really hard bargain. <laughs> we, could, we could gladly do that. Okay, so is the is that the problem? Is that switch lines the wrong way or something? Okay, the switch is definitely lined the wrong way. Okay. Uh, we're already sitting there like that. Oh, we're already... It's hard to tell if we're derailed or not because we're centered on the three-foot gauge. So, God help us. We've made it further than we ever have before, everybody. I'm gonna just ease it, ease it up to the first curve here, though. Oh, night job's playing. I released a video about this on my other channel today, by the way. In case you didn't know, I have a second channel. It's all about music. Heist Studio. It's linked in the the main channel. Okay, so it can kind of. Oh, what the no! It just started to eat it and just. I'm not sure what in Whistle Land was going on there. I'm gonna try it one more time. Back it up. We know how far we can back it up, and then we'll launch it forward. Chicken feeds. Yes, I have a second channel. Surprise. There's four videos on it. It's only about music, but yeah. Okay, throw the switch. We're learning all the procedures here. Get in. Bar in reverse. Kick off all of the air. 
I do think that that's actually accurate error. Oh god, oh god. I already have the throttle like wide open. What am I doing? I was busy being impressed by I think the automatic actually works like it's supposed to. And it has overcharge. All right. What you got? What you got, boy? Okay, Duro Valley. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shoot. Let's get that booting. <laughs> Let's see. Non VR version. When you record with Khan tomorrow, talk to him about playing Scrap Mechanic. We actually talked about that today already, because uh, he apparently did like a uh, how to run trains puzzle thing, and he wants me to try and do it, which sounds fun. Drew, you must be a legend because Kenosha just played on likes after Johnny Cash. You finished Rio Grande Glory Days in Cabo last week. That was rad. I've st I haven't made any progress on it recently, but I need to. Titanic had a better turn radius than the S1. Oh, beautiful. All right, well, let's see. Well, while that does its thing, we're booting DRL Valley. Uh, let's see. Doot, doot, doot. What can, what can I pull up? Let me see. Anyone, anyone want a, a, a sneaky preview? Sneak preview of something? Does that sound exciting? Maybe, perhaps? Which shot should I show them? The one that is tagged as shit posty B roll? No. No, I don't think so. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Okay. This is a. We'll start with a very important clip. Very important clip from the East Broad Top here. <laughs> Everyone's just saying, yes, yes, yes. Very, very important clip. Let's see. 3841. So I'm just going to start record. <laughs> do, you, do you even need to watch the clip to see this? So I'm just going to start recording and like pan around. And we're all frozen. Oh, uh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Picture. Uh huh. Picture. <laughs> <laughs> We did, we did a small amount of trolling. It's fine. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see, 3844, how about that clip? That, this is a very important clip here as well. Watching the small child es &D live, there you go. How's Dero Valley going? It is still loading. It's at 86%. That's where it always pauses. It's fine. <laughs> Let's see. Let's, I've got a couple actual decent clips that we can... One or two. Oh, it, the sounds of derailing have started happening. So Dero Valley's probably loaded. It's fine. We'll, we'll watch one more. Your computer's running low on storage space. What else is new? <laughs> okay. And it is clip. Let's see. Do, 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 do. 10.492. So close. Okay. 
Apparently the uh, video is not going to work this time. Hang on. Hang on! There we are. 16's a pretty choo-choo. They, re they really did a, a brilliant job restoring it. But yeah, Southern Valve Gear is weird.jpg. Let's see. I've already moved it. And they've already... So it's centered right now. There's no way for me to zoom in on the video. And then that link moves forward. Weird. It just looks like it's missing the union link, because it is. And then this is all just weird. Weird choo-choo. I shall someday understand Southern Valve Gear, but today is not that day. And the cars, the new coaches they have are just beautiful. That is so weird. Yes, very strange. All right, DR Valley has loaded, so. I'm staring into the sky and I stare down and, oh, right. Let's uh, let's change games in the, uh, the dealio there. And uh, we can just uh, live with the consequences of our actions. Right. Right. We did this. Right. What fresh hell has happened? Well, I mean, we blew, we blew up the oil field. It's the most recent time. It's fine. Okay, so somebody said blow up the harbor. So, I mean, we could do that. Let me catch up on chat real quick. Do, 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 do. Okay. I was pretty caught up. Four dads. Breakman for one month. Iced tea watching heist. Yeet trains. Good life. Glad. Skitty cat. It's fine. He said the thing. He said the thing. It's fine. KDS, I'm aware that they're making a camelback. I love it and I hate it at the same time. I mean, I mostly hate it because it's a camelback, but I love it because uh, it means that I'm going to get to play with the camelback and just be like, why? <laughs> I need to fool around with the gauge mod. I know, I need to download that. I didn't realize it was released. A million people sent me messages about it. Um, I didn't know it actually came out, though. So, yes, we shall... Uh... <laughs> We shall play with that at some point. How did it go? Poorly. Correct. You adore those things, but they're so strange. They're so strange. Why does everyone ping me when I'm live streaming? It's not, it's not how that works. Her girlfriend made that camel back. That's awesome. And we're dealing with loading again. Oh, and that Whitcomb tiny thing? You know, I think I did install the Whitcomb. We haven't looked at it yet on the channel. <laughs> Luna likes trains. Hi, Luna. Conductor for eight months as well. You're the Camelback creator. You're welcome. You should take the Whitcomb out for a spin. That's right. That's also yours. I think I have it installed. In which case, we could take it out for a spin. Well, you know, Mark. <laughs> Petition to ship 491 over to the East Broad Top. No. When is Simulator being released? Probably in a couple months. 16 or K28, you can only have one. <sighs> probably K28. Despite the fact that 16 is actually probably more powerful than 491 these days. Single tier. You saw it on the spawner list in the PRR coach video. Good, I'm glad. I thought I downloaded it and installed it at the same time, but. Did you shave your beard? Yes. Did you not see it in my recent video where I had a mustache? It was a whole thing. I still need to make the video from Durango, let alone the videos from the East Broadtop. Ah! We'll get to it. 
one hour operating a camelback or a full day in the big blue dumpster camelback hands down keep me out of the dumpster why are you still loading dear Old valley is it trying to calculate what's happened to the harbor next one at wall at east bt should be wall shirts i don't know crew would you rejoin the railroads online team and give them the chance fuck no is that my outside voice that was my outside voice. That was my sober outside voice, too. No. What would happen if you put weed in the firebox? It would become fire. Will 491 and 493 ever double head? New. No. 491 would cost $70,000 to truck one way to Durango. So. Literally zero visibility when reversing because the firebox and the tender in the way. That's fair. Pure K4 kid, chill, please. Okay, I think Dero Valley has stopped responding at this point. Teleporting to the harbor was a mistake. Because we are still stuck in place here. Loading, please wait. How about I kill you with the task manager? And then we launch it again. It's not a good, not a good games being smooth today moment. You take it by the 70K estimate you've looked into this. Uh, we looked into bringing 493 to the museum because 493 was originally theoretically going to go to the museum. I don't know how realistic that was, but that was the story we were told. And we went and looked at it and did the assessment and got it prepped and all that stuff. So we're being tracked there then. Outpull of between 491 and 16 would outpull 491 right now. 16's been up. Uh, pressured and 491's been down pressured, so. John Kissinger, what's your opinion on doodlebugs? There's two near you in the area of Pennsylvania. Doodlebugs are weird. They're neat, but they're weird. You're gonna have to warp back to fire the camelback on TV. Yeah, see the problem? Need to get a bigger hard drive. I want to talk about how much storage I have. <laughs> I need more storage always. That's my secret. Do you think the T1 take curves better on trains in? A little bit better, but not much. Thumbs up for that RO reaction. I'm glad. 60,007 BLN. Hi, hi, so you're a trainee fireman on the Festiniog Railway and would be interested to convert you to double fairly sometime. If I was given the chance to do anything at the Festiniog, I'd be so game. It's just a question of getting over there and all that. I would love to go see it. We meme on the fairly. I don't understand the fairly, but very cool machine. Thank you for the super chat. All right, well, we've uh, loaded back in up here, and apparently teleporting is a mistake, so we're going to spawn. Let's see how fast we can uh, run the little Whitcomb boy, I guess, down to uh, down to the harbor. Doot, 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 doot. I guess we just got, yeah, Whitcomb. Oh, he's a cute little, cute little boy. Little doot. Doot, doot. Such a strange little machine. Very reminiscent of 50, and I believe you actually ended up making a skin of it to make it look like it was 50. Oh, that's the default Whitco. Did the skins not install right? Either they didn't, or it, it, you have to spawn it separately, kind of like Greg's stuff, but I don't know. That's a whole door on one of these? That's weird. And the other cab doors over here? That's really weird. 
What is Peach's way? Uh, engine is 90 tons all together, put together 150 tons. Big choo-choo. 307,250 pounds is what it says on the folio. Luna likes trains. By the way, there will be two more camelbacks coming from me soon. A 480! And when support is available, an 0880. Why you gotta do this? Why you gotta do this? Oh boy. Thank you for the super chat. That's gonna be uh that's gonna be a vibe. Alright. Um uh, where did you hide the breakers? Ah, yes, there. Oh god, it sounds like it sounds like a clapped out school bus that I know very well. AKA Algoma Central 4. Oh, that's where that starts? Okay. Does the horn not work? It's a cute old choo choo. Knife Fury King. Where did 491 get her nickname from? Uh, we can't remember. It's either me, Brett, or Layton that came up with it, and nobody can remember who or why. Is this a go kart? Might as well be. The official Mark Heist Huber Wellness Commission. There they are again. We were once again doing a wellness check on Mr. Huber. As always, the commission takes the current state of Mr. Huber very seriously. I'm tired, but doing well. You have so much less facial hair. Yes, I know I do, Gingy. So much less. Apparently nobody watched the, the two or three videos that where I was just a mustachioed man. My analytics told me that nobody watched them, but I don't understand why. Oh, now a horn works. That's cool, Daniel Ramirez. I saw one of the not C-19s. Mustache Heist was scary indeed, which is why he went away. Beard Heist will be back someday soon. All right, let's put this up to speed here. How long has this engine been in the game? Uh, it's a mod that's been out for two, three weeks, perhaps? It does not go fast, but that's not its job. Is it hard capped at 43? What if we have places to be? Oh, I don't know. This uh, this switch might still be lined. Oh yeah, Marty. Most of the stuff in Dural Valley that I play with these days is mo uh, is mods. Simulator's coming out soon-ish, and it'll have a bunch of new trains and new things and features, but might be still a couple weeks out. S accidentally sent you the unfinished version, that's why it doesn't have skins. Oh! I can download the new one from the actual place then. Dish Doggy Gaming, you worked out of the Huber Mansion for 15 years in Marion, Ohio. Well, that's cool. I probably toured while you were working there. How close is that little thing to Pee Wee? This is much bigger than Pee Wee. It's closer to Diesel 50, but very not the same. Similar in overall exterior appearance, but that's about it. John Kissinger, come visit the Allentown in Auburn, Colbrookdale, and Reading and Northern, all within an hour of each other. East Coast trip is on the on the docket. We'll let uh, let everybody know when it's like an official thing, but it's uh, it's in plan. Ah! Being run over to death by the front of this thing. Nero. Very cute. 
I don't know what to say beyond that. That's a very cute little choo-choo. Oh, the engine temp's getting a little warm. Does not like being a notch eight. That's fine. Daniel, I signed up to volunteer on the website. And then I started volunteering. <laughs> Kev, before you die. I mean, what if I want to be on top? What if I want to just be on top? Oh, I guess I can't be on top of the locomotive. Well, I, I can platform my way there. Mmm, fumes. Fumes! Um, yes. Assuming the East Coast trip includes Penzi, Railroad Museum, and Strasburg. Probably. We haven't, like, figured out exactly what it looks like. We got some ideas, but we gotta make sure it's realistic. I gotta have time off and all that stuff, so. Is it, would this thing be a gas mechanical or a diesel mechanical, actually? At this size? Because 50 is a, a gas mechanic or a diesel mechanical. Not, it doesn't have a control stand like this at all. Making them in both diesel mechanical and diesel electric versions. Okay, that's cool. It's neat, but it's very slow. King Bo, will you post the stream as a VOD? You need to sleep all streams end up as VODs. That's how that always works, so feel free and go to sleep and catch it tomorrow, man. Take it easy. To very big boy, go to the harbor or wherever you're going and just wait and see how long it takes to get there. I mean, I was gonna spawn in a steam engine and shove this, but I mean, if you wanna, if we want a slow ride, you know, we want to fog hat our way there. I mean, we could do that too. Throw water on the engine. That would help. Why are the wheels so small and so close together? Uh, uh, torque reasons? I don't know. Probably. This is a switcher. I'm not supposed to do much else. Don't let it overheat yet. Uh oh. It smells like Kenosha started playing. Any tips on getting your hands on little engines and big men? Good luck. It's hard to find, unfortunately. Well, we better get to the harbor in about four minutes. I am the smoke. Did you visit the Trolley Museum in Windsor, Connecticut? I don't know. Perhaps. We need, to, we, need, we need to see, like, realistically who's running when, what makes sense, when, like, there's a whole bunch of logistics that would go into me coming out east and seeing a bunch of stuff and whatever. You want to cool down already, sweetheart? This is supposed to be the fat. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter if it's the fast part of the part of the railroad because we can only go 42. Whoever made this needs to make a supercharged meme version. I'm right there with you, the very big boy. Luna, you should do that. Make that happen. Make an ebook for little engines and big men. I want to. That the publisher wasn't terribly interested in uh, in like a audiobook or anything, which is unfortunate. Happiest in like four. Um... Um, 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 maybe I'm still alive. 
something has just transpired. I don't know if if the stream's up. Steam's broken. Is stream looks like the camera's broken. Everything's not responding. This is scary. What is the computer doing? Dear L Valley got very mad at me. Are you still there? OBS is fine. Chrome is not fine. That's probably bad. Is anyone there? Can you guys hear me? <laughs> Exit page, I guess. I, th I think the I think the stream if if the stream is alive, it's about to be dead because my computer has hicked up. Perhaps, maybe, camera off, camera on. Chrome is broken. Hey, look! The stream is actually still up. That's exciting. Hey, look. Look at that. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I don't know what happened. Um, and apparently OBS's preview is frozen, but apparently it's not actually frozen. Yeah. So, uh, DRL Valley crashed so hard that it, like, soft-locked my entire computer it killed smells like Kenosha. It froze OBS. Like OBS is stuck previewing me just like in the bottom corner. Uh, and it killed the live stream page, which I thought I always had to have open the creator side of the live stream page. But apparently you don't need it open because I'm watching on the, the public thing. So, um, Apparently the harbor is off limits. Dero Valley is very broken. So um yeah. I guess we'll 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 get into some tunes and uh, and we'll wrap it up then. We've been we've been we can't blow up the harbor and I don't want to wait for Dero Valley to launch for another 10 minutes. Anyway, to very big boyd instead of some alcohol give the trains <laughs> Give the train so you can blame it on the train. Then the train will need to pee in the cup. Trains have peed in the cups. The, the cup that's actually behind me. This is authentic Durango and Silverton 481P. Anyway. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Waifu scientist gambler. Computer can no shit itself. Just about. That was a new one. Luna likes trains. The Whitcomb was too powerful. I guess so. So we're here. Yes. If you're in the black screen to do. Okay. Well, anyway, if your storage space is that low, less than eight gigs, that's the problem. I have five and a half gigs on my C drive. I have 109 gigs on my D drive. I have 24 gigs on my E drive. I have a terabyte and a half on my four and a half terabyte external drive. And I have 226 gigs on my M drive. And then I have a 25 terabyte external drive over there that I need to uh, uh, go do. So, um, yeah. So, stuff, things, words. Anyway, uh, people were talking about 12 string song. As the as the the first song, at least we can uh, we can get with that. Clearing up space on the C drive will help. Okay, I really need to stop uh, 
running uh, my C drive dry, but um, I hoard footage. I really just need to actually uh, like have better hard drive setups in general. Like it was fine when I was just doing games and things, but now that it's like, oh yeah, I'm hoarding weeks and months of 4K footage. Yeah. Yeah. So got to <laughs> you got to move that data, man. It'll help. It's fine. Is this song in in standard tuning? I don't remember. We will find out. It's a very big boy. Da da to to what? Weird? What? Did you stroke your keyboard? Uh, Kesaya, if that's how you pronounce your name. Yes, 20 is the angry elf. 346 is grandma, and 491 is peaches. Let me make sure this is the right tuning. It's an E flat tuning. Of course it is. So we won't use this guitar. <laughs> Strasburg Railfan ID, you forgot to show the 611 thing you mentioned earlier. I would on this stream, but it's somewhere in my bag and I'd have to go dig it out. Sorry. Perhaps next time. All right, that's the right tuning. That's about the right tonal vibe for this. Uh, let me know if the balance is good.
yeah, that song. <laughs> Let me catch up. You guys were you guys were chatting seriously all the way through that, and I can't read while I'm trying to play. I see, very big boy, you drank the train pee. Don't do that. It's oil. Don't do that. That will hurt you. And judge your boy. Cue no hearing. Well, good. <laughs> You wanted to know what it tasted like and you think you have brain damage. Yeah, don't do that. Custom songs. Yes, it is a custom song. It's an original. Midland, this is why you love this song so much. Thanks for playing. Well, thank you and thank John Deere and everybody else. Ryan Rails, Jimmy from the Cog once said, remember folks to save your files on the mountain because it's as close as you can get to the cloud. Limes! <laughs> Limes! <laughs> 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 I need to give one of those to Jimmy. <laughs> oh, goodness. Let's see. The Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 flashbang sound effect has significantly intensified. <laughs> Thank you, John Deere. Yeah, uh, for context for all you uh, who don't know the detail about that song, uh, that is one of many that are going to be on my second kind of solo album I'm working on. And it's, and it, I don't know, it, that one just kind of came together pretty well. And so that's just a demo with just guitars and bass, but I'll eventually re-record it with drums and, and the whole thing, and there'll be vocals at some point. We'll figure that out. Nazi, thank you once again for blessing us with the song again. Keep up the amazing work. Hope you, you and everyone that went had fun. Yes, we did. Hell of a way to end your drive home, the blizzard. <laughs> Glad you made it, evil me. All the lines. Will there ever be any bass content on the music channel? I'm sure there will be. YouTube will watch your comment if you use too many emojis. That's great. Mystery soul album, yeah. I recently got a new bass. I don't know what bass things we could do. We could do some bass stuff. We haven't I haven't done bass stuff on the channel. This is actually uh, my newest instrument is this. It is a Fender Player Plus precision bass. So it's got uh it's got uh, the kind of the PJ setup. So it's got um um uh uh P bass pickups here and then the extra jazz bass pickup. Um, so it's very fun. I don't know. It's got a lot of cool uh, tonal possibilities. So. Yeah, I don't know. We could we could do bass things. What what is a bass sound like going through a Marshall Super Lead? Probably is gonna sound like Lemmy Kill Killmister. If I had to be a betting man. Yeah, it's a uh, that's about as obnoxious as I thought it would be. I don't know if I want to run this through my amp for real, though, because I don't know if I can make it sound not farty. Yeah, I don't know if it's just going to it's just going to be a fart machine. I'd have to set up some stuff. I don't know how to play the Doom theme. Anyway, I'm not much of a bass guy anyway. I own basses for recordings. Get back in your bag. <laughs> yeah, that bass has just been sitting back there the whole time. You're one hell of a guitar player. Thanks, Johnny's Garage. True nub, dude, hope your night's going well. It is. Finally got a trip to Colorado set in stone. You'll be there for the Nergage convention. Well, uh, that's a good deal. It's going to be fun. Did I take audio engineering in high school? Uh, no, I didn't, actually, somehow. I wish I did. 
I didn't have time it time for it. Yeah, convention's gonna be cool. There's gonna be secrets unveiled there. Shh. Redacted, redacted. Ryan Rail, Colorado is known for its mountains and soft granite, but ice really rocks. Get out of here. Leave. Might need a carpenter to make you a proper guitar rack. I have um, a wall mount thing that I can hang like 13 or 14 guitars on, which is what I need. Um, but I don't, I didn't know how long I was going to be in this space. So I didn't want to drill a bunch of holes and mount it and stuff. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, more guitar. Uh, yeah. I don't know. What, what other songs? Someone said, uh, someone said Tuesday Sunrise. That's a fun one. Um, I don't remember any of the lead parts, but it's a fun part. So let me grab the 12 string. Uno segundo for favor. All right. <laughs> the Craig shall the pedal board for his bass. That would be fun. <laughs> Yeah, we are uh, very much in the wrong tune. Tuning. Let me uh, let me pull up the song, and then we'll spend five years tuning. So if you have questions, now's the time. Money from Pink Floyd, that'd be fun. I do know that. I, I at least knew the guitar solo at one point. We could try it. Do you want to play in 7-4, right? John, dear boy, best days to go to the Near Gage Convention are all of them. Uh, the museum's doing special ops for uh, convention attendees on Friday. Um, and then otherwise, all of them. Can I play The Ocean by Zeppelin? Yeah, there's actually... A, I have a full band cover of me playing all of the ocean on the channel, actually. Just that one Friday of the Narrow Gauge Convention, yeah. vaguely tuned so we'll, uh, we'll do this thing uh let's see movie nights those are mickley's scheduled thing these days if you're able to buy tickets for the convention on the website you not the museum's website but the convention's website i think um the convention's late august i don't remember the dates yeah <laughs> anyway let's see about doing this
hand was cramping something violently in the midst of that tune. Oh, that's a weird hand position workout that I have not played in years. And as Kroom noted, yeah, my 12 string probably needs new strings. It doesn't want to stay in tune. Yeah, uh, I'll definitely do a, um, a behind the song about that on the second channel. It's a fun one. The thing that I always, I wrote it for 12 string and then I, I wrote it before I had the 12 string and it has that finger pick section on 12 string that was written not realizing that finger picking sucks on 12 string. Yeah, that's uh, that's some stupid stuff. Anyway, I'm gonna put this thing down. All right, perhaps one or two more, and then we'll we'll see what we uh, finish off with. Let me catch up on top chat, folks. <laughs> redacted, super redacted. Yes. <laughs> please, crew, please, for the love of God, stop blowing that horn. Uh, if you join us at the, the t if you unpause and join us at the live part of the live stream, you'll note that uh, there is uh, there's no horn anymore. But uh, I guess there's no point in me pointing out the fact that you're behind on the live stream is there because you will not hear it until we are done. <laughs> Ryan Rail, did you buy that guitar under contract with no strings attached? No, I did not buy it under contract. And, uh, Oh, lordy. Neon Xenos, I hope you're doing well, Heist. Hopefully the blizzard that's hitting me calms down a bit before it hits you. Thanks for the trains and music tonight. Here's hoping. Somebody somebody said money, and I want to see if I can remember the guitar solo. I'm sorry. We're going we're gonna to Pink Floyd it. It's going to get me a, a, a copyright something something, but that's fine. When can one purchase a lime? Uh, we need to set up like a new website and stuff. So yeah, uh, eventually. Do, 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 do. Let me find the song. Pink Floyd, Pink Floyd. Let's see if I can raise myself up. Is this guitar in E flat as well? Why is everything I own in a weird tuning? I could have sworn this was in standard. Don't own too many guitars, kids. That was also an E flat. Why did I not? Oh. Nah. 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 Whatever. We shall. We shall tune. A guitar that does not have an obnoxious uh, t t tailpiece.
All right, that's vaguely in tune.
That's all I wanted it for anyways. <laughs> oh, God. Um, it has been probably three years since I played that, and it's probably been five or six since I learned it, so the fact I remembered as much of that as I did, happy with. 8th of January, I, got, I tuned the only guitar that I had that was an open D out of open D. Chicka Feeds, uh, all the Railroads Online songs, which is my favorite. I don't know if I have a favorite. I don't have favorites of things anymore. Um, let me look through. I don't know. There, there's like little moments in each ones that I love, but I don't like one. There's no one song that's like, oh yeah, that's the one. What are the chance we can get some Metallica? I don't know. Metallica. 8th of January. I, uh, it's 1016 in Colorado, but I'm used to East Coast time from the trip, so I'm going to be heading to bed soon. Could I do my song Golden? Oh, God. <laughs> Not without a capo and a double neck guitar. <laughs> I got the double neck in the other room. I don't know where a capo is. That'd be a fun one to do. I love that song. Do I have, uh, do I like vinyl? Vinyl's neat. I don't have a turntable, though. Banjo Breakdown, Thundering Down Track. I do have a guitar that's an open G. Oh, the old Hotel California. Um, I need to know more of it. I've covered it before, but I only, know the, I only knew the one half of the solo, and I haven't bothered to learn the other half because it's a, a dual thing. Railroad Blues, Railroad Blues is all right. I don't actually know how to play Bad to the Bone. I always BS it. I don't know. <laughs> it smells like Kenosha. Smells like Kenosha. I was going to remake the Roads and Line stream? Oh, yeah. No, yeah. We've already remade some of them. If you listen, uh, if you listen closely in the roads and line videos, you'll hear them. This might be in the right tuning for New Line Groove. Yeah, check the description for Discord. Any ELO? No, I don't know any ELO. I know a lot of ACDC and some Led Zeppelin. That's the the the, the most of what I do know. A song, a real song. Are we in the right tuning for that? Let's see.
something like that. <laughs> yeah, that's New Line Groove. I couldn't figure out what to play. <laughs> I did yeah, play the favorite song you've done. I don't know if I have a favorite Midland. I just got done saying I don't know. I don't know if I've got a favorite. Simpson Music and Productions. Thoughts on Hell's Bells? Hell's Bells is kick-ass. All of it. Uh, the whole Back in Black album's kick-ass. If we want to uh, just take a mad high solo, we could do that. <laughs> Johnny Begin. I've covered Johnny Begin before. I don't actually do it justice, though. I had a guitar strap around here somewhere in this mess. Because if I was really going to shred some ACDC, I'd want to be uh, up and doing it. We've done Stairway before. I think we'll do Thundering Down Track because that's a fun one and it's fast paced and that'd be a fun one to end with. So let me grab the, the list poll. Can we see the mess? No, God, it's a mess. You're not going to get to see the mess. Hopefully this is actually in G and not like F sharp or something stupid. We'll find out here. Uh... It is confirmed in F sharp. Let me go grab the acoustic. Five seconds. Okay. Maybe this is in tune. <laughs> he said after tuning it while running upstairs. This is going to be thundering down track, and that's going to be the last one for the evening. Uh, Kroom, I don't remember 8th of January. I've, I've said it a couple times. I appreciate the fact you lock it, but I'd have to remember how to play it, and uh, I'm not up to it at the moment. <laughs>
Huh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. I forgot that I wrote that song to be a pain in the ass to play. <laughs> That's a fun one. That's a fun one and a half. Oh, man. Yeah. Uh, okay. So for those that uh, I saw a couple questions in there while we were going. Uh, Midland, thanks for 55K. Thank you. John Deere Boy from Rolleston Rails. Oh, I saw this once and I, it skipped my brain. My apologies, Rolleston. Thoughts on booster steam locomotives? Ah, they're neat. They're definitely like a, a slow speed freight drag kind of thing, but like plenty of locomotives have really made use of them. So they're pretty cool. Um, that <laughs> guitar may need to be water cool, right? <laughs> Is this one not on the soundtrack? No, it's not. That was going to be a volume two tune. It is released. It is on my channel. Um, if you search for like steam up close and personal burn them and run thundering down track, it, it's on the channel from like maybe June, July, sometime this past summer. Anyway, uh, thanks so much for watching guys. That's a fun one. We'll, we'll play some more tunes. Crew will try and relearn 8th of January. So. We'll catch y'all next time. Thanks for watching.